Now this little volume device that we have here is actually really interesting. It works almost exactly like the on begin overlap inside of Unreal Engine. So what I've done here is when the player actually walks into one of these volumes, we'll have a creature show up. Now you'll notice that I have a concave volume right here, right? It's got a hole in it. And that isn't actually going to work. What this is actually being driven on is the complexity of its uh, collision right here. So let's actually do our player collision. And you'll see that it's not actually concave itself. So that would and actually work. However, if we do have an object that's like this, and this is one object, you can see that I've got one object down here. Um, it is this one. It has a couple of different pieces to it where there are actually different collisions on it. So this does work. So this is really kind of exciting because we can create some really interesting complex collision things out of one mesh. So if we go into the game and play this, you'll see that even if I walk into this blank space, it's actually gonna spawn that creature because I'm actually inside of it. I do have it set up so as soon as I walk out of it, he will go away. So this is cool because I can walk into this one and as soon as I walk out, he will disappear. And any one of these actually works. So this is a really interesting way to kind of build your games and your game design when you need something very complex and silly to deal with. And now that was very interesting. He walked out of it and he like an heroed. Did he just seriously just do that? He goes into it and then he walks out. Ooh, oh, that's unexpected. All right, so cool. A little Easter egg inside of there. That's fun.